Hi, church family. So in church, we learned about resolutions that will help us resemble Christ. So we've been talking about God's word and how God's word helps us refine our resolutions so that by God's power, the resolutions that we make and keep will ultimately, uh, those resolutions that are empowered by God, fueled by God, uh, mightily uh, enacted by God as he works in and through us to make good resolutions that result in faithful works that our faithful works, which are the outcome of our good resolutions, that all of that is empowered by God for the glory of Christ so that in Christ we are glorified as well. So we're not just making and keeping resolutions apart from our attention and acknowledgement of who God is and what he's done in Jesus. So the question for us today is, God, what do you want me to do that will reflect the life of Christ? What problem do you want me to solve that will resemble Jesus? What goal do you want me to set that by God's power, Christ's energy through me will ultimately lead to my looking like Jesus? That's the goal, because if you make a resolution and you keep a resolution, yet don't look like Jesus as a result of the resolution, what's the point? God's Word gives us wisdom about making and keeping resolutions. Lord, who do you want me to love today? Father in heaven, as we go about into our world and as we think about your goodness and your mercy on this new year, Lord, give us wisdom to discern and to refine the resolutions that we make and keep so that whatever problem we solve or whatever goal we set will result in a life that resembles Jesus Christ for his glory and for the good of others. In Jesus' name, and the church said, amen.